Hey okay, we're back with the Friday night edition of I've Got Your Cookies Here. And it's raining, but when you have dogs, you have to walk them, rain or shine, especially when they're like Angus that has to be all by himself. Unlock the gate. Anyway, Christopher, if you're there, I couldn't find the video, but the, they make the dog stay, and then they get in a car, obviously. Either they have a camera set up, or someone's obviously spotting the dog there filming it. Oh, and they drive away, and come back, and the dog is still sitting there, and they want to know if your dog's trained that good. <laughs> yeah, no, thankfully, no. <laughs> no. Thankfully, no. So, I've got a lot of speed. And he's gonna go for their poop, and I'm gonna get. I'm I'm not missing a beat. I didn't I didn't break my step at all. I didn't alter. You know they've got to believe their ability to alter your behavior is limited to what you're making them think. You know, if they think, well, I poop, all I gotta do is stop pooping, and these people stop. Oh, I'm getting gone. You're fixing to see him come. Great big. Now, there's another one where they're training in the parking lot of his uh, million dollar training facility, which is that business park. And he's making it stay and strutting around, acting all erratic and weird. And then a car comes, a big dually diesel, and drives in between him and the dog. And they put huge distraction. I would have deleted that as quick as possible. God forbid I was that unalert that I allowed a car to drive between me and the dog. Uh, you show Godfrey stuff like that, he freaks out. You know, never let a... Dogs and cars, that doesn't prove anything. You, you, you may be able to control the dog, you can't control the traffic. You know? That's endangerment. And then one, there's like a little... Uh... Look at him, look at him. So I've, I've preserved plenty of free agency. And I could walk around with this dog, too, and say, well, he doesn't run, he doesn't run. I made sure he ran. I made sure he ran in the beginning, only because I know any kind of bully breeds or what, they can get slow real fast. Angus! There's my Nick. Here he comes. <laughs> Yay! He's such a funny runner. <laughs> yes, you can keep him. Kind of run sideways. I, you know, I, either run sideways, maybe, you know, he is, if you said, well, he's learned to sort of scrunch up that side of his body and run with the kind of a cockeyed little thing. So, yeah, that's what it looks like to me, too. <laughs> anyway. So, yeah, the other video with this guy, there's like a little... Uh, there's like a little, you know, triangle thing in the middle of the road. And there's traffic going here, here, here. He puts the dog in the little triangle island and goes across the street and allows traffic. I said, I'll tell you where I put my expensive client dogs. No place like that. No place like that. It's honestly, it's ridiculous. I couldn't find it, though. Everything. I tried looking up dis extreme distraction, but everything on their site's extreme distraction. So, no, couldn't really find it. I think people need to understand stage distractions are easily seen through by people and animals. I can see through them. I don't even read body language. I stumble through life doing God knows what. But I can see stage distractions. Yeah, yeah, let's hope these neighbor dogs don't come out. I'm already planning my strategy. If you said, what is it? Get gone up this, th up this way, hitting my nick and running as fast as I can. That's my plan. <laughs> Hi, Joe.
Oh, who was it leaving the dog? That Nick from Unleashed Canine, you know, which everybody's after. And I was just after him the other day. I'm going to go back after him and say, well, do you realize Fred House and Ann Ivan are both after you too? So it's not just me. Sure, I'm nobody. I'm some girl whose socks don't match who has a social media addiction. But these people. All right, so I'm keeping my eye on him. And, you know, I'm saying to myself, he does have a couple of behaviors that he does. One, which is rolling like that. Mm-hmm. And if you said, what did you do? I got my hand on remote like this, and I went like that. I went like that. You've got to learn to do the remote without looking. You've got to just be walking along. It's got to be second nature. So I just, I knew I was at zero. So I went like that. I went like that. Oh, look at him way over there. Yeah, well, you're not going to get far, though. He's not going to get far. So that tells me, you know, and I understand that now. If you're getting no default at all on your recalls, it's, you're not doing it right. And if they're not even going to default to it, they're really not going to do it when you need them to. Anyway, look how much fuller the pond is. Thank God. And hopefully it rains all night. Yeah, that was a good little workout for him. But I'm saying to myself, I'm not going to call him at all without generating momentum in the opposite direction. 